Hey there, good morning everyone. Thursday the 4th of November 2021. This morning's devotional is a reading from Deuteronomy chapter 31 verse 6 which reads, Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or terrified of them. For the Lord your God goes with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. Life can be very hard at times. And Henry Ford said, Whenever everything seems to be going against you, remember that the aircraft takes off against the wind, not with it. What he is saying here is that the aircraft has no chance of getting off the ground unless it has some form of opposition. It has to go into the wind in order for it to be lifted to the heights of its possibility. When we come into the winds of opposition, the winds of adversity, there are three possibilities that exist for us. The first possibility is that it can drift us. In other words, get us off the course that we are traveling, causing us to lose focus. Drifting at the best of times is never good. Think of it this way. If a ship's engine fails, then it drifts along, being swept by the water currents. Second possibility is it can sift us. Now, sifting is very good. Think of it in terms like this of getting the good sifted from the bad. Bakers always sift their flour to get the unwanted bits out. It also makes for a much nicer cake. Difficulties separate or sift by getting the bad out of us and so that we can hold on to that which is good. So sifting is good, unpleasant but good. What I also know, as Henry Ford did, and this is the third possibility, is that the winds of opposition and adversity can lift us and raise us to a new awareness and new possibilities and a higher ground. The prayer for this morning is that the drifting will no longer feature in your life after today, that we are going to let it sift us and make us better and lift us and make us bigger. But we first need to face the opposition and adversity. You will not experience the joy of rising above the circumstances unless you are part of the process. My dear friends, when faced with opposition while going down the runway of life, will you let that opposition cause you to drift, sift or lift you? May the Lord be with you. May he bless you. May he cause his face to shine upon you and be with you always. Goodbye.